My personal favorite Twitter client for the iPhone is Twitterlator. I love the interface. It's very clean and uh, very easy to use. When you first click it, it'll go directly to your friends, all of their tweets that they have left. And you just scroll through them like you would any other client. What makes this one as cool is it shows you a picture that people upload in TwitPic. It shows it and you just click the little arrow and it takes you directly to TwitPic. Making it so you can see the picture bigger, leave comments and so forth. Also, if you really like somebody's tweet, you can star it. You know, save it like as a favorite. It's really easy. You just click the little star right there. And then there you go. Saved. Now you see my tweets. And my replies, everyone's tweets. Go to topics. There's lots of different categories for you to go to. Really easy to find. Now when making your own tweet, it's really simple too. Just click it and it goes to this lovely screen. Just type whatever you want. And as far as pictures go, I know a lot of other Twitter clients, they allow you to take pictures, but this one's just a lot easier and a lot cleaner. So you can take a snapshot or you can upload it directly from your library. <laughs> Click library and go to the camera roll and pick your picture. There's my Max, my little doggy. See? And if you don't want to take one from your library, you can just take a direct snapshot. Clear the photo. Click the camera again and then take snapshot. And take it. It's really easy. Once you take it, you can retake or you can use it. It's up to you. Also, this little pin right here, when you click it, it gives you a link or, you know, your tweet. It makes it a link to see exactly where you are. So it uses GPS to find you. And it gives you a little map right there of a pinpoint of exactly where you are. So that's a cool little feature. Also, it makes it really easy to reply to friends. Just gives you a list of friends. You scroll through them and find the one you want. And then when you click it, you know, you'll reply to them. I find that really fun and easy. And that pretty much does it for the Twiddlator. I love the interface. I love that you can change the color. Mine is purple, but you can change it to any color that's listed. They have a number of colors. So yeah, there you go. Twiddlator.